Bam, bam, bam. Hello, hello. Just uh, currently starting the stream. Okay, so this should be the third part. Uh, so let's continue, I guess. Let's just all be careful. Okay. If you spot anything, call it out. We don't have a lot of time. Isn't it weird how dispensers are carved to look like spooky little faces? What do you dispense, little guy? I get the feeling that we don't really want to find out. Get behind me. <laughs> okay. Probably going to be a bit string. Oh no, it's pressure plates. And he's walked on him. I don't know. I'm moving. That's probably not a good thing. Oh, come on, dispenser faces. I thought we were friends. Run! <laughs> Run. I'll be honest with you guys, I'm not even like hitting the correct direction. Just doing it anyway. Don't really I'm just gonna We're trapped! We activated the dispensers with that pressure plate. If we can figure out a way to trigger it again, I bet that'll shut them off. There's a crafting table. Maybe we can make something useful. Good thing, good thing we become friends with Lucas. He knows his shit. He knows his shizzle. Empty your pockets. Let's see what we've got to work with. I have a few sticks left over from building the shelter last night. But I'm I've got some flint and a piece of string. That was Lucas. <laughs> chicken feathers I picked up after that chicken machine exploded. Well, let's see, I've got some flint and steel, a sword, oh, and some string from a spider that I fought in the woods earlier. Yeah, boom, boom, string, boom. String, sticks, flint, and feathers. Arrow, and some, and a bow. Okay, so if I remember rightly, it's... That then, that. And that should make a bear. Yeah, and then we're gonna need some arrows as well. And then, I don't know how many it's gonna give us. I'm hoping it gives us quite a few. Ah, oh, do this. Is it just the one? What a shot! Nether Maniacs, luck is changing. Yeah. I don't get why you, you just go back to the, you go to the dispenser and pick up some more arrows. It's just, it just seems like a little bit this of common sense. must be their enchantment room. Doesn't this look like Ivor's creepy basement? Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. You'll never know. Find anything useful? Not it's sure about useful. Pretty much the same as Ivor's. There is a lot of history in this room. No, st yeah, I've got three hours. Um, I'm probably going to live stream. Two uh, K fifteen WWE in a bit. Um, later the on. The battle was fierce, but the Order of the Stone emerged triumphant. Saving the land and ensuring that peace and prosperity would reign forever. Well, not exactly forever. These five, five members, five friends, together would give so much to gain their rightful place as five heroes. <laughs> they would author their own end. They would slay a dragon. Ivor was a member of the Order of the Stone? The stories never mentioned him. This is so crazy. This might explain why Ivor had such a grudge against Gabriel. 
They lied to us. They lied to the whole world. Why would they do this? This is so crazy. The Order might not be what we thought they were, but Petra is still out there. That monster is still out there. Jesse's right. We need to focus on what we came here to do. Where do these stairs go? Where do they go? Only one way to find out. Now this is cool. Wow. What happened to the walls? More like what happened to this whole place. <laughs> This must have been where they met. So, where are they then? Gabriel said that once we find the temple, the amulet would lead us to the Order of the Stone. Well, what are you waiting for? Pull it out then. Here we go. Is no. <laughs> something supposed to happen? Well, that was a letdown. There's got to be something we're missing. Look around and see if you can find anything. Okay, let's have a good look around. Oh, I like this view. Where's Reuben? Um, I think we've kind of forgot about Reuben, to be honest with you. What you looking at? Nothing. Whatever. Axel? I was just trying to figure out where Petra might be. I mean, I know she's going to be fine, but I was just curious. We're going to find her. I don't really like Axel, to be honest, guys. Throughout this game. Check this map. It's a map of the entire world. <laughs> this is way nicer than the one at Endercon. What you're reading? Anything interesting in that book? The only thing I've found so far is that the amulet was used to track the positions of the members of the Order. And does it mention how? It's less technical and you know, more historical. Oh, I think you're gonna have to put the put it on that. It's the same as the amulet. Oh, Reuben is out. Reuben's over. Just make sure that there's nothing else, guys. Quickly. No. Well, at least I figured that out. <laughs> it's absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible. How did they build this? Okay, now I'm impressed. This looks like some sort of tracking system. It's the order. It's showing where they are right now. Look, we don't know enough about how this thing works. Maybe the amulet only tracks them when they're on the surface. Or maybe it doesn't work when they're in the nether. We have to go off what we do know. No, oh, Lucas. There are only two lights on that map. There are only two heroes left that we know what we need to do. Petra's relying on us. That Withers and Gabriel. Is still out there. We know that Gabriel was trying to tell us something. 
got to find the Order of the Stone. But there are only two lights. There are only two members of the Order left? He said Soren was missing. That leaves Magnus. Or Eligard. Well, let's head out. I'm not going with you guys. I have to stay here. Ooh. If I know Petra, she's probably doing everything she can to find this place. She's still out there. She has to be. We might need your help out there. You should come with us. Come on, Lucas. You don't need me. <laughs> this is where I should be. If there's even a small like he's trying to be alive, really dramatic. I have to stay. You guys don't need Go. me. Get help. Go get help. I'm gonna focus on making this place safe before nightfall. I'm gonna focus on making this place safe. Pretty big though. If we're gonna have a chance at fortifying it, I'm gonna need some help. If uh, maybe one of you guys could hang back with me. Sounds like Olivia will have you totally covered while me and Jesse are out finding Ooh. Magnus. Finding Magnus? You really think that's how it's going to go? We need Eligard. She's the world's greatest engineer. She'll figure out a way to stop mm -hmm. that thing. I think we're going to take the girl we're with us. To destroy it. And when it comes to destruction, Magnus is the master. You're a smart person, Jesse. Obviously, the smart thing to do is to go get Magnus. Do. I don't really. I don't really like Axel that much, but I kind of want to get like the destruction guy. Jesse, the point is, you should be going to Eligard's. It's the clear choice to make. You've got to come with me. You're my best friend, Jesse. It's you and me, like always. Think about it, Jesse. This is more of a gut call. We need to make sure we get no, this right. I'm trying to wait for the to chat to stop. Whatever decision you make, I'll be cool with it. Really? As long as it's me. Come on, Jesse. This is an easy call. Let's just Olivia, go with Eligard. You and I are going to Eligard's. Awesome. Axel, you stay here with Lucas and get the place ready for when Petra shows up. What? With that guy? I'm right here? <laughs> Come on, Axel. Only because the fact that I don't really Petra's like it. actually like Fine. Axel. I'll do it. I kind of want to get Magnus though, but take it. Only because of Axel. Should have really left Axel and Lucas behind together. Guys. No. Please hurry. Grab the amulet first. Yep. Let's just watch what happens next time, I guess. Jesse and Olivia return to the Nether, intent on finding Eligard, the Redstone Engineer. And find themselves in a place of mechanical marvels, Redstone rarity. Amazing machines, limited only by the imagination of their brilliant creator. While the great storm grows, consuming everything in its wake, time is running out for our intrepid heroes. <laughs> to be honest, I think 60% of the people went to go get Eligar because of, I don't really think that they like Axel. He's kind of a dick. Well, that's going to be it for the Minecraft stream, guys. Um, I'll just let these credits roll, and then after that, I will get uploading to... YouTube and then I will start setting everything up for the uh, rest of my universe mode live stream. I think, yeah. So, thanks for watching guys anyway. Um, don't forget to leave a like when this video is on YouTube and don't forget to follow me on Twitch. I'll be back for episode 2 when it comes back out. But thank you anyway, guys.